Hey, what's up guys, how's it going? Uh, today I'm gonna show you guys how to connect your AirPods Max into your PC, most likely Windows 10. Now, the first thing is that you don't have to disconnect your AirPods from your other devices. If it's either Android or iPhone, it could be connected, that doesn't really matter. Now, the second thing you want to do, you wanna click on Start from the Windows 10 at the bottom. Then you wanna to go to your settings. Once you go to your settings, you want to go all the way where it says devices, where it says devices, Bluetooth, print, printers, and mouse. What's, once you click on that, now you want to click on add Bluetooth or other device. And right here at the, at the top, it says Bluetooth. You want to choose it one more time. Now from here, you can add a device. Now from your AirPods, what you want to do is you want to press on the sync button here. So the sync button is basically this one right here. This is what you use for the, uh, the noise cancellation, but you could also use this to pair your AirPods Max into your PC. So right now I you wanna click it for a couple of seconds until the white light from the bottom starts to blink. So let's do that right now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so for around six to seven seconds, and as you can see there, it says headphone audio. And it also says the name of the AirPods. So you wanna click on that. It's connecting. Now on the headphones itself, the light turns to white all the way to green. On the computer, it says device is ready. And on this page, it says connected voice and music, and you're pretty much are good to go from there. Now, when you do have these connected, you could still use the wheel to change the volume to play and pause. And you could also use the noise cancellation as well. So if you want the transparency mode, you could turn it on. Or if you, if, or if you want the noise cancellation, you, go, you could also turn that on as well. So right now, let me put these headphones on. All right, so these headphones are currently on, as you can see in my reflection, I have them right now. And if I turn the wheel right now, as you can see, it goes up and it goes down. And I can hear the clicking sound on, on inside the headphones as well. And once I go all the way to the highest, I hear the, the little uh, boop sound. I hear the little pop sound. Now, if you're looking to your Bluetooth and, and other devices, you could see that the, audio, uh, that the audio option, your AirPods are connected. All right, so if I click on the AirPods, it only gives me two options between disconnect and remove device. I don't think you have any more options than this. If you want to change the action on one of the buttons of the AirPods, I'm assuming you're gonna to have to do it through your iPhone on the Bluetooth settings. All right, so I'm currently playing a YouTube video here, and if I use a knob to change the volume, it does that for me. Or if I play in pause, I could also do that too. But the one thing that the AirPods Max cannot do when you have it connected to the Bluetooth on the PC is that, let me play this. If I take off the headphones, as you can see, the video is still playing. So the sensors right here does not work. Now, once your headphones are off of your head, this does not work. You cannot put the volume up or down. You cannot play and pause or anything like that. You have to have these headphones on in order to use the controls. Now, when you are watching YouTube videos, there is a very slight latency when watching videos and playing video games. It's not 100% perfect. It's not as perfect as if you're using a MacBook or an iPhone device or an Apple device generally. So if you're gonna use it on PC, there is a very, very slight lat latency, but it's not bad at all. All right, so I'm trying to test out the microphone on the um, AirPods Max, but it's not working because right now, I'm at the default microphone and as you can see there, it's actually detecting the default microphone of the computer. But if I change it to AirPods Max, as you can see here, it's not playing anymore. I have no idea, maybe it doesn't support it. So let me go to the microphone from the Logitech um, camera that I have installed here. And it's detecting that with no problem. But if I go back to the AirPods Max, as you can see there, it's not working. So I'm assuming the AirPods Max microphone does not work with uh, PC. Now, once the headphones are connected, 
if you want to connect these back to your iMac, you could also do that with no problem. So let me go to my iMac Bluetooth here, connect the AirPods. And as, he, and as I heard, I heard the beeping sound. That means that the AirPods are connected to my MacBook. Now, if I go back to my computer, it says that the AirPods are paired, but not connected. So if I want to connect these, even though it's, con even though it's currently connected to my MacBook, I could also connect it with no problem. So let me click on connect here. Let me click connect. It's connecting. Give it a couple of seconds. And um, yeah, right now it's connected. And I heard the beeping, I heard the beeping sound in the headphones itself, meaning that I could start using the AirPods Max with my computer. So I hope you found this video useful. And if you did, make sure to like and subscribe. And um, I will catch you guys on the next video. Peace out.